Yeah, oh, it means the world. <laughs> like it, it's one of those things where, for like for us, the individual awards are, are cool and all, but it's it's the show itself because it's of Kendra and Neb's last musical together, and that that for us, that's what we really we're, we're behind them 100 percent on everything they do. So it's it's. It's an honor. It's an absolute honor, and, and we are just so happy to be here and to be back together again. And it's just we're having the time of our lives right now. I mean, the fact that there are two of us from the show nominated up for the award is just makes me so so proud. And it's a testament to, to the production. Yay! Yay! Yeah! 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 All right. Thank you. What's on stage? Thank you. What's on stage? <laughs> What's it feel like to be here at the Olivier's? Incredible. It's it's marginal. It's it's as cool as. But not cooler not, than the ones Not quite. <laughs> Pretty awesome. I mean, it's just, what's wonderful is knowing that there are so many of my friends that are here who are actually nominated. And it's just lovely to be in and around this event with this atmosphere. It's brilliant. We're just one of the first to have Catherine Kingsley. Oh, yeah. Kingsley. Yeah. Look at the glamour. In the background. Yeah. Photo bombing. Photo bombing. Yeah. Photo bombing. Woo! Really exciting. Really, really exciting. I've, I've seen lots of friends come just coming out the red carpet. It's wonderful. <laughs> Seeing all these people that you know, and meeting people that you don't know, that you know you, you hope might be there, you, you might be able to say hello to them. You know, peers, heroes, friends. It's great. It's a great night and a wonderful evening for it. I'm really nervous. <laughs> uh, I'm more I'm nervous about. Now. I'm more nervous about going and the nominees are. Oh, that's all yeah. I'm going to say as well. I had this whole chat with my agent going. No, I, I can write something funny. <laughs> she went absolutely not. Oh, and six other nominations six. we've got. So Absolutely. seven nominations in all. It's not bad. How does it feel to be part of a show that is so successful? Oh, it's fantastic. I mean, what could be better? <laughs> it's nice. It's always nice having a show to go to. But if it's a if it's a, a, a big show that everyone's loving, nothing but marvelous. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was it was exciting enough doing the play in itself, and uh, it was sort of most satisfying and, and thrilling professional experience of my life. So this is just a, a very delicious cherry on top. If you do, you know, you give a year and a half of your life to something, it's always lovely to have a day in the sun. You know, <laughs> it's nice to have a day where you recognise everyone's work and what they do, even if they don't win, just to be nominated. They're, they're you know, it's nice to have everyone on the back. It gives them the strength to keep going. Yeah. It's really mad because of the company that I was in, the three guys are incredible and lovely looks as well. So yeah, it was totally unexpected. Award ceremonies, they're not just about winning things, they're about celebrating things. Everybody who is nominated tonight deserves respect and applause and ovation because they have sacrificed so much to tell stories in the theatre. That feels like the most joy in the whole of the world. It's fantastic. It's fantastic. <laughs> what else can I say? I can't believe we're holding it. It's just joy. Joy! Joy! To, to have that kind of recognition from the industry to say that we see your work and we like what you're doing, keep on doing it. That's what you live for, isn't it? You want to know that what you're doing is reaching out there and that people can take it on board and, and like what you're doing. And to, to have this that says, we like what you're doing, is the ultimate. So I have a very, very happy day. Mark Gattis and Coriolanus. Gatis, Gatis. Mark Gatis. It'll, it'll cut you. <laughs> <laughs> and Coriolanus, uh, Andrew Scott in Birdland, yeah. uh, Benedict doing Hamlet next uh, year, and yourself doing Richard III. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Sherlock's taking over Theatre Land. Well, I don't know. I mean, you know, we're all people who have done theatre for a long time. Do you know what I mean? It's just that we now happen to have that label to hang on us. But, you know, we're all sort of theatre bots. You know what I mean? We've all been doing it for years. And, um, I mean, obviously, if Sherlock helps in any way, then fantastic. But uh, no, we'd all be there anyway. I d well, I don't know where we'd be, but we'd be doing plays. Any chance for Sherlock the musical? Put it to them. I'll, I'll let you be the executive producer on that I'll one. I've got an idea. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. I'll do that. I like it. I like it. You can feel the weight of the history of the Royal Opera House stage kind of just on your shoulders. <laughs> You're like, oh, no pressure then. And of course, the luminaries that are in the, the audience, you know, the real great and good of theatre. It's like, wow. And there's me, little little newbie, just fresh out the out of, off of one kind of genre into this one. So I did feel a little nervous, but um, once I open my mouth, I'm fine. You know, and more, uh, some of my mates who've been out there in, in other categories who've lost, and I could see them trying, really trying to have a nice evening. 
<laughs> it's horrendous. It's it feels incredible. It's so probably, substantial. Yeah. yeah well, Doesn't it? In my hand? Yeah. Yes. Um, I, it's, yeah, I can't quite believe it yet. It's not quite sunk in. No, it's amazing. I think, I think it'll become real for us when we get to go back and be with our people. Yeah. Because right now, as lovely as you all are, <laughs> We're really nervous and weirded out. You gave the most enthusiastic speech of the night. You're Did hyper. I? Did hyper. I? I guess I. He's always like that. Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of who I am. I think. He's an American. But I also, this doesn't happen to. Yeah, I'm an American. Yeah. This doesn't happen very often, and and to it doesn't happen ever. So thank you. We all are. We've worked really hard together as a group and as a company. And I know family seems so trite at this point, but it is like a family. So to all be up here celebrating together is, is amazing. Now, what I'm mean, always set out to do is do a good show and do something that meant something to us. And it wasn't really about what are we going to do differently than anyone else. It was just this is the script we got. It was a fantastic, funny script that had, you know, what was fun about it is it had good uh, contemporary satire combined with good old fashioned entertainment. And that's what we set out to do, and I think it was in such a nice, comfortable package, even though it was sort of out of the box, that that's what made it work.